Hello and welcome. We've travelled today to the east coast of England, to Hull. I'm Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon. And on the menu, this European Championship group stage encounter. It's Sweden against Bulgaria. Thanks, Derek. Good atmosphere here. Everybody looking forward to what should be a really entertaining game. This is how the starting lineup looks today. Quite clearly, they've thrown the shackles off. Looks great with the ball, Derek. The four forwards up front. What happens when they haven't got it? The two midfield players are going to be very busy today, but maybe not as busy as the back four. The opposition starting 11. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack-minded with the three up front. The three in midfield supplying the width as well, but I'm a little bit worried about the three centre-backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? Lindelof. Forsberg. Olsen. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Well, they're going to forge ahead. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Well, you don't want to concede early in the game, and the goalkeeper was the hero there. He's likely asking himself, why did I shoot from so far out? Well, he's not the only one. I'm asking him, and all his teammates are too. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Marlos. It needs an accurate cross. Stepanenko. Malinowski. Can they get in behind them? They've won back possession. looking position you've got to say well he's got to be disappointed with that pass Christopher Olsen excellent vision and up for grabs off the keeper well it came to nothing in the end and they do like to press whenever they can and space here on the flank Chance to play it in. Malinowski. Stepanenko. And here's Marlos. Can they take the lead? And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay. It's a really lovely through ball. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Into the advanced position. Robin Quaison still trailing but they're upping the pressure Forsberg Olsen Isaac cuts it back and a goal to level this contest all even Well, here's the replay. Great disguise on the pullback cross, and then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. He 
Even Steven won a piece in this match. Yarmolenko. On the ball, Tara Stepanenko. Dangerous looking attack. It's opening up for them. And it's with Izak. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing. And now they sense victory. Well, let's see that again. Oh, it's so sweetly hit. Look at his technique. Absolutely brilliant. He's got the power, he's got the accuracy, and now he's got himself a goal. Well, 2-1 it is here. Augustinsson making progress Robin Kwaison Augustinsson and offside unfortunately Giving the ball away. Hectal. There will be one minute added on at the end. Lustig. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Now the attack fizzled out. Ekdal moving it forward. Good defending to prevent the chance. Now can they counter clinically? Marlos. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And he's found a bit of daylight. Emil Forsberg. Now they've given him too much space. Throw-ins given. This looks promising. The cross is on. A deft clearance. Yarmolenko. Malinowski and Sigankov has it using all his defensive acumen to cut it out Andrei Yarmolenko now as clean as a whistle that challenge Isaac Isaac. Christopher Olsen. What a poor ball giving possession back to the opposition. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Isaac. And it's with Ekdal. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. 
Ekdal. Very comfortable when in possession. Jordan Larson. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Alexander Zinchenko. It's with Kriftsov. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Ekdal. Excellent ball over the top. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. An opportunity to add to their advantage, but not taken. It was worth an effort, wasn't it? Too much space was given to him. Takes the shot on. And time for the change now. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Plenty of options. Berg. Well, they might be onto something. And a goal! That's his brace! They just can't keep him quiet! Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Inside the final five minutes now. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. He's in here. Surely, there it is. Victory more or less guaranteed now. Well, so often or not, the post can be the goalie's friend. Not on this occasion. So close, but it's in. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Denis Popov. And that's it for tonight. Full time and an encouraging start for them. Three points from their initial fixture lead. Well, it's everything you want from the start of match one. Good, strong start. That result will give everybody confidence, especially the players. Well done. Well, he put in a really thorough performance tonight, Lee. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp. Constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.